What's up, people? So some of these Kelly Monaco fans really need to chill the fuck out, to be honest with, with you. Like, I understand some some of the real fans of General Hospital may be upset that Kelly Monaco got fired for nostalgia reasons, but majority of this that are starting this petition and all this BS is a bunch of clout chasing bullshitters right over here. The Sam character has not been relevant that much in a long time, and you know it. Her character, there's just nothing for her going on right now. Like, she's in some boring relationship with Dante, and nobody wants to see it. Every Like, you could look at random posts from everywhere were saying that we need to bring back Lulu for Dante. When is Lulu going to wake up for the coma? They're finally ready to bring back Lulu because guess what? They finally could develop storylines for Lulu that writes themselves. For Sam, that that ship has sailed. She has been on this show for many years, which is an accomplishment she could be proud of. But the character has ran its course. Which is the way it was meant to be. She came on. She was this former con, st- con artist that um, ripped off a bunch of men. And it turns out she did that for her for her brother. And she did some deplorable things with, uh, with Elizabeth and Jake. Um, when she sat there and watched them kidnap them watch Jake be kidnapped and then hired someone to terrorize Elizabeth and her kids at at the thing. She did a lot of deplorable things, but eventually she she then became a super couple with Jason and they had a good thing going for a while up until twenty twelve and Jason had to leave when Jason left the show, her character, I mean, got into some boring relationship with Silas Clay and whatever else but since then it's just been since she became the mom since she got her baby back with from that whole baby switch her character had been going on a downward spiral since then i remember when i was expecting sam to be all fired up and get revenge on elizabeth for the whole keeping jason as that when billy miller was still in the role no she didn't do that she just handled that like a mature adult because you know what that's what the character was meant was was meant to mature. So if you try to come up with top storylines and material for her now, um, it's not gonna it's not gonna work work out without regressing her character. So if they don't have nothing in mind for this Sam character. Let her ass go. And I believe most of them, most could rational fans could understand that. And did, what you also need to understand, y'all, is that General Hospital is last in the ratings, okay? They are last in the ratings. There's only three shows on air. Days of Our Lives got taken off of air because the the ratings weren't good enough. They were gonna get canceled if they didn't get moved over to Peacock, okay? The budget is no joke. So if you don't have a budget You don't have a show. So Sam, if they don't have anything for her at this moment, she's an actress. That's what actresses do. They go through this. Actors and actresses all the time. If you don't have anything planned for them, then you just don't work. Okay? Like, so all y'all demanding... Um, taking this to the extra level, talk about, well, why are you getting rid of Sam? You should be getting rid of this one, that one, this one, that one. Maybe they should, because first of all, some of them they should also get rid of too, to trim the fat. But that don't mean you need to get your way to get Sam back. The Sam's character has ran its course. It's done. So get the hell over it. Like, y'all take, y'all just want to jump on something. A lot of y'all just want to jump on some bandwagon bullshit, though. That's what I don't respect. That's just what I don't respect it. Like, and and for those that genuinely are Sam fans, are genuinely sad that this end end of your era is coming, 
there's something called old clips. Go look up old clips of when Sam was actually relevant and feel, and feel young again. Um, and you'll find some pleasure with that. But for all you petitioners that are de just demanding shit, like, whose paychecks are you signing? Okay? Do you wanna do you wanna foot over that bill? Cause she's a very high end act actress on these shows. She's a veteran. So do you know how expensive her salary probably is? So why won't you cut that check for her? How about instead of this bullshit petition, how about y'all all join a GoFundMe and go pay for her salary for whatever the amount of that contract exactly? That's not gonna happen, is it? So Get off, get off um, Frank Valentini and all them necks. Get off their necks. The decision has been made. Sam is no longer going to be on General Hospital. What you should instead do is um, continue to show Kelly Monaco some support. Make sure that and root for her to go find a new show. We got the gates that are coming back up, coming in January. Maybe they could find her a role on there. I would prefer if she goes over to the Young and the Restless, she might be able to be a leading lady over there because God knows they need a new leading lady somewhere. They need the next generation for something. Um, she can go over the Days of Our Lives on Peacock or she could even go to The Bold and the Beautiful. Those are options. Or, or she could decide to leave daytime and go to prime time somewhere. Okay? She got many options. But instead of exploring that, you guys just want to come up in there demanding shit. Now I'm just like, I'm not, I don't see that. Because I feel y'all are just being bandwagon bitches at this point with that. I'm not talking about the real the real ones. I'm talking about the ones that are taking it the extra mile, demanding other people for getting fired. I'm not talking about the real Sam fans. Let me be clear on that. I'm talking about the bandwagon Karens that are demanding the other actors be fired and demanding that this be fixed to their satisfaction. Life don't go your, your way all the time. At the end of the day, business is business. Are you starting petitions every time? Someone gets laid off um, during a recession? No, you're not doing that. You don't give that one fuck because you don't know them. It just happens. It's business. Move on to the next. But that's my take on this Kelly Monaco situation. Let me know what y'all take on, is in the comment section below. And I'll see y'all all later. Peace.